What's going on guys and welcome back to another in this leaf video. So guys today I've got the final tin in this set of three that I finally found out of my store which is the Typhlosion tin. Now this is, looks so sick. Um, in the end it was really requested in my final video that I do open the Typhlosion tin up so why not? I thought YOLO let's do it and this looks sick. This Typhlosion on the front just looks so cool that uh, what is it? A prime card? Yeah, it's a prime card. And uh, you get your little tribal artistic paint on the front here. Typhlosion there on the front looking like a boss. You get four booster packs. I'm not sure if that's more or less. I'm, you might have got three in the other ones. I can't remember, honestly. For, uh, for Alligator on the side there looking cool. Uh, Typhlosion on the other side. And then you got a Manganium on the, uh, on the, what is it, back. And then on the back here we got your starters again here. Get a little paragraph if you guys are keen on reading that one. Hopefully you can read that. And uh, Pokemon International Company, and it's got sort of the uh, colors, so blue, red, and green. So without further ado, let's crack into this one, see what we do get inside of this. Uh, hopefully something pretty cool. Uh, goal for today, pull a prime or a half card, that'd be pretty sick. Otherwise, just get a holo, I guess, is my uh, general thing out of tins. Just one holo would be nice. Their prime looks so sick. There we go, our four packs. Yep, that's four. I thought it was only three there for a second. There we go, Typhlosion Prime there. That's so cool. Love the way he's just jumping out there. He's like, ah, I'm gonna destroy you all. Ha ha ha. He's, yeah, that's, I don't know, is that a, it's like a hint of green there? That looks pretty weird. It's like a green patch coming out. Someone, I think someone let one go. You know, someone did a, uh, if it's just me, it stinks in here. I'm kidding, that's not what the green is. Maybe, probably not. But, uh, but yeah, here's our four packs here. I'll just seal up the back. Get that tin looking snazz in the background, just chilling. So we got two Huck Old Soul Silvers in the front there. Don Fan, that looks cool. Then we got a Diamond Pearl Legends Awaken pack and a Platinum pack. So uh, yeah, let's just jump in straight up like that and go into our Platinum first with the black, but uh, what was it, black border I was going to say. Sort of got distracted um, because I, it sort of brought up the point that a lot of people were saying in the what was it, the previous video, that there's heaps of good cards you can pull in Platinum, and the ratio for pulling it's really cool, so hopefully you can pull something nice. So we got a pimple up there, kicking things off, looking awesome. Uh, Surviper, he's, rah, I'm in the rocky dens, I don't know why. Wormpool there, Lotad, he's just chilling. Uh, Armor Fossil, Volpix, that's pretty cool. Tor uh, Torkoal, a Reverse Tauros, so it looks like it's three from the back, and a Hollow Slacking! That's sick! Holy mother duck, that's an awesome card. Oh, it's like George, George, George in the jungle, watch out for that tree, caca! I say George, oh George, oh George, oh the I don't know, but that's so cool, I love that. Oh, that's an awesome looking uh, slack or, uh, slacking there. And then our Grotel is our last card, so it's three from the back, but it looks things. Now for a hot gold soul silver. Um, I don't know. I, I can't really remember what you can get inside these. I'm, I think it's still you can get prime cards, but uh, yeah, I'm not not 100% because there's like those half cards as well. But I'm, yeah, I'm not 100%. Uh, Parasect, Hophip, Coughing, Growlithe there, Spinnerack, Totodile looking, oh, he's just jumping for joy there. Farfetch'd, he's chilling on his little sticks. He's like, yes, this is my stick den. Back off, punks. Oh my god, we pulled a ho- Oh, what the hell, it's a hollow? Is there a- Yeah, that's a really weird hollow. But we pulled a hollow Gyarados. Mac and cheese and meatballs, that's an awesome looking hollow. That's such- I don't know, what is shiny there? Is it the ocean? Yeah, the ocean's shiny. It's like a really weird hollow. It's like really thin. Uh, it's not like you can obviously tell, but there, that's probably a better way of doing it. But um, yeah, that's awesome. A Gyarados hollow. I love my holo cards, um, and Gyarados looks so baller. That is really cool. I'm going to put that one at the back. That's really nice holo. So two from two so far. We're doing really well. So now for our next pack of Heart Gold Soul Silver. Hopefully and pull another holo. Chances of that. Pretty low in Ando's chance, in Ando's chance meter. Do I have a chance meter? Yeah, I think I do. Oh my god, there's Heracross, and as someone pointed out last time, Unlisted Leaf, hey? Joining him for his party. Uh, Bill there. He's, he's all formal looking. He's got his nice polo chop on. He knows what's good. He knows what's good. Uh, Bayleaf there. Sandstrew. Coughing. Mareep. Magikarp. Hopip. Oh my god! We pulled the mac and cheese and meatballs! We pulled a prime Don fan! This is ridiculous! Was that out of the Don fan pack as well? What are the chances? Holy mac and cheese! That's insane! Oh my... I've had so such good luck out of this hot gold soul silver and these tins. I've two primes or three i'm not sure we pulled insane oh that's so sick and that don fan's just looking there he's like yes don't disturb me with my pointy horns or i'm gonna stab your face up ha stab zap zap that's so cool oh that's awesome 
Oh, I'm so happy with that one. Um, yeah, that's that's a really cool looking one. He just looks so evil in that though. He's like, <laughs> I can't get over it. It just looks very evil. Um, the Dom fan is a chiller, so it's all good. In the hood and a rare Frelegator finishing things off, which is so cool because Frelegator is a boss. So we'll put him with the other hollow. I don't know where that first hollow went, but we'll put them two at the back there. Such sick pulls. Hopefully we can finish it off with a four from four. Diamond and Pearl Legends Awaken. Please do something good for us. I don't think I've opened this set before, so it's all completely new to me. Oh my gosh, we're not... This is a good start to the video. <laughs> I'm so weak. <laughs> I do crank my 200 kilos every day, ladies. Don't worry. Yes, that's right. One hand as well. He's 200 kilos sometimes, you know. They take a toll on me. Uh, Poker Radar there. Persian. Metang. Oh, Yanma. Horsey. Cubone. Taylo and he, what's he doing there? He's like flying away. Kaka, guys, watch out. They're not feeding us bird seed. Uh, Chin Chiao Dratini reverse with a little rainbow there. Double rainbow all the way. That's awesome, that Dratini. It looks pretty cool. And a regular rare victory bell. Uh, yeah, that's, I don't know, that's still cool because we pulled three from four, which is perfectly fine with me. Um, what the hell? We managed to pull two hollows. God knows where that other hollow went, but we have a hollow and a prime. So cool. I love these cards. Um, yeah, fantastic pulls out of these three tins. I've had such good luck with tins. Um, I think I've only had, had one dud tin before, which is the Keldeo. Uh, 2013 10. Go watch that video if you want to see the worst polls in history. But, uh, but yeah, tins always treat me well. What do you guys think of these tins uh, in the comment section below? Did you guys get some yourself? What do you think? But most of all, what do you think of guys? What do you do? Keep on gaming. See you later.